What's up guys, Octus Gamer. We are back playing Rage 2 and the last episode. Our commander in chief died. Let's see if we can jumpstart this. Clear. Wait. Ah! 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 Fuck's sake. I was conscious. Yeah, you were. But your shiny new armor needed a jolt. So we lost her, so man. This is it then. This is all that's left. Just over 20 survivors. We're still digging out the ruins. I saw Prowley. Cross, he. He killed him, man. We saw the whole thing. I know y'all saw it too. Her. He killed my mother. I don't know how. But we gotta stop them. And I'll personally wring the neck of that goddamn wrinkled bastard. I never really believed the stories. That the authority would return. Well, they did. And we gotta do something about it. Mom knew what to do. The Rangers knew. Wait a minute. They kept their files, the logs. They kept them in the Presidio. The Ranger CP? You nuts. Only Rangers can go in there. Look at me, Lily. I'm the only Ranger left. Holy shit. You really are. Damn right. What else we need to talk about? Hold on. Let's open that log. All right. Hmm. Lily. So this is just a catching up on the characters. Weapons. Mm-hmm. Inventory. Okay, okay. Okay, we got it. Let's talk to us some more. No, she don't want to talk no more. Alright, so basically now we need to follow uh that arrow. Before we do that, I like to look around. What's in the back here? I don't want no hidden little gem. <laughs> I don't miss anything. Okay, so nothing's here though. Oh, 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 see? This is what I'm talking about. Seeing a scanner. There you go. See, this is why I like to explore a bit before moving on. We're not even sure who's gonna come back to this area, so. Hold on, guys. I'll come down there in a bit to y'all. Still looking around. Okay, cool. First Jenner's private. I want a head count. None, Sarge. Not a single Not one! Dead all the hell. They're all dead? Not here, sir. No word they just found. Up and vanished into thin air. There's gotta be bodies. I wanna see bodies. I'm telling you, they took them. They took them all. Every single first Jenner. Same. Alright, so um Basically, the ones I ordered dead. They got snatched and kidnapped. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I told you, man. You gotta walk around. You gotta look around, baby. Okay, got everything here. Bastards. You goddamn bastards. Okay, here we go. Oh, you got something for me in here, Prowley. Unknown intruder. This is Presidio Security Protocol. State your name, rank, and business. Walra 
Tight Unit, Corporal Walker. I'm here to find information about, um, about my... About Ranger Unit Sergeant Irwina Prowley. Processing. Security protocol override. Thank you, you dumb robot. Okay, we're not gonna walk to that yet. Walker, you're seeing this message. It means we've been hit harder than ever before. I'm likely dead, and Vineland is laid to ruin. It also means that you're the only living ranger, and that the authority is back, and they must be stopped. All these years, I kept you away from the ranks of the rangers, as I hoped you would be spared in an attack like this. Likely targeting rangers and elders. You're my hidden weapon. Sorry I kept you in the dark. You now have full access to Vineland's primary arc and the technology inside, the old ice box. Imagine spending the arc counting experimental something, 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 something. Okay. Hundreds of years in this thing. It was me, your parents, all the originals. Froze up like popsicles. From here we emerged and kicked the authorities' ass. Inside the arc is an ID accession distributor, which is my greatest gift to you. A device which augments the nanotracks in your blood and gives you, well, superhuman powers. Oh, that's nice. I like There's that. No other way to put it. Enter the arc and activate it. Well, can you give me those? Let's see what kind of surprise you got for me here, Ghost Prowley. Superhuman power. Let's do this. So we about to be superwoman. We already know it's gonna go down, man. First, before we go in. Let's look around. Ooh. Don't tell me I get myself stuck down here now. Oh yeah. <laughs> Come on, there you go. She didn't want to grab on that, so let's don't explore down there no more. Got for me. So I'll stick my hand into this strange hole and hope for the best. Yeah, let's see what happens. Here goes nothing. Welcome to the simulation chamber. In here, you will be able to gain proficiency in the use of your arc weapons and any ID accessions. You have successfully installed ID accession dash. With the dash accession, you will be able to evade incoming threats and become harder to hit. Mm, left button. Good. Again, please. And again. Good work. A simulation will allow you to train in the use of your dash accession to evade enemy fire. Oh, I did not come. I did not come here to get trained, man. What the hell is this? What's up, buddy? Oh, you meant to kill me. No. Try again. Okay. Stop. Fail. Try again. Shut up. Once more. Let's go. It's just a simple dash. Stop wasting my time, man. Dang. That was unnecessary. Just, just, just a prompt should just come and say, "Hey, now you know how to dash. Press this button." I didn't have to come in this room and do this shit. Yeah. Really have to eat my arm. Come back to the main hall. I have more information for you. It feels weird taking instructions from my dead aunt. 
Let's go back. That so. It was designed to put an end to the authority permanently. We knew it wasn't likely that they'd just disappear despite their losses. And furthermore, we knew that General Cross was in possession of technology that allowed him something akin to eternal life. Project Dagger was scrapped when Vineland closed its gates to outsiders. But a pact of sorts remained between me and the other three original Daggers. First, John Marshall of Gun Barrel. A tough, no-nonsense old war horse who led the first fight against the Authority. He understands the importance of technology and spycraft better than anyone. His skills will help keep you off the Authority's radar. Second, Lucy Hagar of Wellspring. Daughter of war hero Dan Hagar. She went from guerrilla fighter to mayor of the greatest city in the wasteland. Her access to military-grade vehicles will be indispensable. And then, there's Dr. Anton Kvasir. Ex-authority scientist turned resistance fighter. He's a genius when it comes to nanotrite technology and mutations. His skills are a cornerstone of the Dagger Project. You will want to know more down the road. Your Ranger Armor CPU has logs that will be able to answer many of your questions. Good luck out there. Ranger Walker. Alright, sounds good, man. Too bad we get too bad we lose her. She was a total badass. So you thought you'd just dump all that on my shoulders and waltz off into oblivion, huh, Aunt Prowley? So how do we get out of here? Well then, I guess it's all up to me now. Thank you. Appreciate that, man. Straight up. Lily, there are three people I need to find. John Marshall, Dr. Kvasir, and Lucem Hagar. They're all part of a Project Dagger designed to stop the authority. That's a pretty tall order. Yeah, your mother is no nonsense, even from the afterlife. Too soon, Walker. Yeah, sorry, huh. Lily. Oh. But hey, I'm ready to trek out in the wasteland. I think I got just the thing. Come see me. Oh. This game is weird. You better follow the path. Because I jumped out of the gate, so, uh. So I'm on the other side of the wall. It's not good. Let's see if we get back up there, because I keep on experimenting, man. That's the problem with me. I just love to do shit. And now... Hmm. Thank you all for the ladder. I thought I was stuck. Just gonna say, don't, don't they have any type of goodies around here for me? Just walking with no no little motivation. Guess who's back? So what you got? Well, I've got lots of ideas for projects, and with your help, we can get them off the ground. They're gonna be key to your survival out there. So let's get you your ride. 